Oh hi there, I'm Tiny Pirate. Welcome back to Airships Thingy Me Thingy Me. Uh, over here we have a couple of our heavy bees, which is good. Three of them, in fact, because we've got this dude coming in. Um, we haven't got much going on here at this facility. In fact, I'm inclined to click to intercept because Black Veil has nothing. And I don't want to lose it. I wouldn't mind having two shots at fighting that fight. So if we intercept them and lose, we can pull back. Uh, I'm trying to build a carapace there, which is the nice bunker we've got over here. I'm doing a refit. Like, refitting these guys only costs me, like, 400 for my badly spelled heavy beetle. So that, to me, at half price makes it quite good. These are actually really expensive to refit, I'll be frank. So I'm not even going to bother. They're like 700 to refit. Seems really pointless. Oh. Oh, it's one of these... These things just seem really pointless. In fact, that's a good reason to keep the normal beetles because they're quite good sacrificial uh, moves against this invading type, this assaulting type group. So aim shots uh, and you guys just normal fire. Yeah, I think that will, we will be okay with this. Yeah, that's not even moving. It doesn't have any ammo. It's just got crew. And I don't know why it doesn't bother moving. It's just too scared of the firepower. It feels like it. Like, it's not move. It's not going to move anymore now. So I think we can... Yeah, we <laughs> it's just been cut in half. Immobile and destroyed. Um, We're going to invade. Yeah, we'll just carry on. We'll just rock this. We'll just rock this fight. We're going to take it to them. And oh, that's actually slightly annoying. It's not the best fight for us. We would prefer our bombers to be here. But we don't have them, so we'll just do this. You guys aim your shots. i right, target the second one. You guys can get a little closer. Oh, we've got steel arm. In fact, we've got steel wall. I don't know why it says steel wall instead of steel armor when we came to design these. But it is what it is, so we'll just live with it. Oh, these could definitely get a bit closer, I think. Yeah, I think this is going to be... I don't know. How are these, how are these faring up? Well, we could go to the other side of these and then flip. Yeah, if we do that, the sun won't be in our eyes. Well, if you weren't so silly... Come on, get over the... Get, oh, I should have told you to flip. Um, move, flip. There we go. Now the sun isn't in our eyes and we're shooting them in the back. That seems to be sensible. You're losing a bit of air. And the rest of them... Yeah, this is, this is pretty much a foregone conclusion. Yeah, we did it, we did it. Good job. So, everything there got destroyed. Oh, and now we've got this fight up here. Where, where is this fight? Oh, look, it's that little... Oh, we're just going to flee. There's no point in even fighting that one. What did we miss? Ah, we missed this. How did... Uh, click to into... We'll just go there. Maybe we'll beat them there and we'll learn something else about them. We'll get this guy in first. Those heavy bees are nice and quick. And then is he... Yes, now we can intercept. Smash them and then collect these remaining forces. So you and you can go here. Carrier to the back. Uh, bombers can start there and then just come pretty much straight up. Can we get a bit low, maybe? Would that be helpful? I'm not sure. Are we are we actually miss we're missing a piece, aren't we? I'm an idiot and I didn't fix it. I did see one of you comment that. Never mind. It'll have to do for now. Whoa, that was a big hit. Um I'll just flip you around and come this way. Yeah, we'll just do the old one two that way. And now we've got a bit more control with these bombers. We should be able to do a bit more tactical bombing. Oh, no. Oh, well. That's pretty much not what I wanted to happen there. Can we not... Can we do anything about that? 
Wow, we can maybe bomb them off. That sucks. Just caught in the wrong time and place. Um, we're going to go this way and flip. See if we can get over here in time. I don't want his forward guns pointing at me. And we're nice and quick. I wonder if that makes a difference in terms of being hit. I'd like to think it does, but I can't be sure. And you come up. Oh, the front has been blown off, so now it's a bit lighter. Uh, you, are you done? I feel inclined to move this over here before the fight ends and I end up with some kind of a mobilized ship. Maybe that'll work. Yeah. Why you're going under our bomber, I won't never know. Come this way. Zip. Look, we're too quick for you, pal. It's going to flip around there. And we're going to come back again. Yoink. Oh, that was well done. Come on, ship. Can we pull out? I don't know if we can. I think we've lost a lot there. Uh, all of ours survived. Oh, that is great. Where should we go? Let's invade there. I feel a little damaged, but I, I, that's okay. We'll invade here too. Try and clear up all of these properties as fast as we can. That is a substantially reasonably tough uh, thing. But these bombers are now very fast. So, well, relative, relatively quite fast. And you guys are... Oh, you've lost your nose somewhat. Come this way and try that. How fast are those? Those no, they're actually they are actually pretty quick. I'm pleased with that. We we stuck a normal size propeller on the back, but that's fine. Oh, did we not? Oh, that's okay because we do actually have fast enough command. We can do this. All right. Well, I know that is a little close for comfort. If we get down a bit, then the big top turret won't be able to hit us. <laughs> the little guys are bombing away. Uh, you guys are happy as Larry. I'm going to move you just to snuggle in a bit. And... I don't actually... Whoa. I actually don't think this guy has met the kind of craft that this suit's taking out. Like, this suit's taking out lighter craft, I believe, because of all of these... Uh, basically, all these bits. Repairs... Yeah, all of our fighters, our little dudes on the little jetpacks. I think they suit taking out lighter gear, but I can't be 100% sure. Okay, you just move on top of him. Like, ram, ram here. Just, no, okay, uh, fire putting out. Oh, you've lost your ability to put out fire. Okay, that's a, that's a real shame for you. Can you at least move over here? Nope, you're just going to lie down and die. Okay. Well, our heavy bees have had a hard fight here, but that's fine. Just fast forward. Oh, they all survived. Oh, that is nice. Okay, so uh, we'll take our heavy bees and send... I think I'm going to send them both home. I can't help but feel they must both be damaged, even if one of them doesn't show it. So you... Oh, no. Ah. Oh. Hmm. Didn't mean to do that. Now invade. Try again. Okay, this time. Night time. Why not? Why not? We can't see anything. And neither can they. But we can bomb, I suppose. So that is fine. Uh, you're the little guy. You can come in. Uh, wh where are you? Come in. Flip. Come and give him a shotgun from the back. Zoop. And a couple of riflemen at the back probably won't do that to, that much to you, so... And you should actually probably just rapid fire into their back. There we go. Nice. Brutal takeover. And can we repair this? So... Oh, they all need repairs. Fine. What did we leave up there? The heavy beetles? Okay. Like, we're just about... We've just about collapsed blue. We might start doing a final ultimate ship. Now, what we were researching now, I'm just going to put my subsidies back up, is articulated legs. So building a final articulated leg vehicle, really, really massive one, 
would be really fun. And until then, I think we're just going to come and do some smashing. And if the fights get interesting, I'll let you know. Okay, so this is the first interesting fight we've had in a little while, arguably. I'm invading the capital of the Northern Alliance, which is that tiny little spot. That was all that was left of one of the empires. Um, the carrier will now get some action. The bumblebees are going to get a bit of a... Oh. <laughs> okay, that wasn't uh, very exciting. Maybe we'll just finish these guys off. Down here, I've been basically chasing the same stupid towers all the way. Or those same stupid weird invading ships all the way. And it's been a little bit annoying, I'll be honest. I'm going to pillage this lot. And then we're going to go all the way back over here. I think now is a good time to build a giant final boss articulated. Uh, we want a large sort of medium, medium, medium. Well, medium, it will have to do. I want a large, massive articulated. What? No, De design land ship. I want a massive articulated land ship. That's what I want to do. It's going to. It's going to kick ass, and we are going to use it. How large legs. What do they even look like? Look at that. Th does that even work? <sighs> it's not the cool spider legs, but it is pretty cool. And, I mean, I'm going to have a look here. Tracks. Can you... No, that looks ridiculous. How we couldn't possibly do anything quite so silly. Can you put legs under things? Medium legs? No. Three lots of large legs. That That is as close as I get. It's like a giant spider bot. I built spider bots before. I know how this works. And I want actually a... Uh, okay, what I really want uh, is... Well, each of them is going to need coal. And I'm going to put... Will that work? That works. You have to, you know, I am quite conscious of the overlay of uh, resources to make things work. We're just going to go like that. It's probably ridiculous amounts of coal. How fast does it go? 400 kilometers an hour. Uh, that's cool. Actually, I'm going to put you back a bit because uh, I do want. Oh, some features here that would be will be handy. Uh, actual fire points because we can, we can afford it. Uh, I am thinking we want uh, some pretty massive ammo stores. We also want oh look at that machine shops. They're like super repair facilities. I have been informed. I am loving this. I haven't even stuck any weapons on it, and it's already completely insane. So we want a steel cargo door. Like, it's going to need at least two. That means it's going to need troops. And I think, should I just stick them straight on top? Do we want to... You know, land ships would be a great way to deliver guards for taking buildings. But I'm not going to do that this time. I think what we're going to do is stick in some some massive weapons. I could put on a ram. That doesn't even look that big anymore, does it? I want a big I want a big gun. I could put on a saw blade. That's not even up to the right scale, and neither will be the tiny uh, sort of cannons I've got, which is a shame. But we can get quite a lot of them. So there is that. I'm going to leave that there. Uh, do we want to do something like this? One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten. Is ten enough? No, it's not. 11, 12, 13, 14, 15. Is 15 enough? No. 16, 17, 18, 19, 20. Is 20 enough? Yes, I think 20 is enough. Call me crazy, but I reckon that'll do it. What else do I want here at the front? I sort of... You know, maybe I do want a little grape shot cannon, just for the funsies. Now what I need is an absolute massive stack of uh, ammunition. 
which I will get to via... This is looking a little silly. In fact, yeah, I'm going to put... No, you can maybe just go there for now. This is looking a little silly, I have realized. And one thing I want you to understand is I have absolutely no problem with that whatsoever. Because this thing is going to pulverize defenses, and that, to me, is great. Uh, fire points. I'm just going to... No, that's actually a little out of an out of whack, and uh, maybe one there like that. And then I feel like maybe some more repairs would be good, like a repair bay here, one here, maybe one here. How many crew do we need? Quite a lot, but that's okay. We've got immense amounts of. Support. Lie. It's kind of a little over the top. Uh, do we need any other coal? We do need medical staff. Commander crew, so we will oh, we'll need a bridge. Going to stack two of them. What is that? Not... Oh, there we go. So i got two bridges. Uh, we'll need a, a crew. No quarters. So that's going to be something like this. So I've actually had a little think, and what I've realized is that I have the basics here for, like, a castle. And so I really should, I really should try and go with that theme. I think that would be pretty good. You know, I don't even think I'm going to need anywhere near that much ammunition. I mean, realistically, most stuff is just going to be, like, destroyed within seconds, right? So would the fire point there make sense with some corridors? Yes, I suspect it would. Uh, and that means we can move the sick bay over here. The repair bays do need to go in. However, what I might do is put them in like this. Um, and put one there. Put this one down here. Maybe put in just some corridors like that. I'll get those in for now. And corridors here. Maybe we'll just use the small fire points and get rid of those so we can have our beautiful looking device. Fire extinguishers, there we go. Maybe a couple of corridors with ladder. So we've got this going all the way up. Maybe one more. No, I'm okay with that right now. I might put corridors all the way up the back just for kind of ease of use and to get stuff down into across to here, really. There, yeah, like that, maybe all the way across. All right, that's starting to look a little bit like a moving castle. We've got 96 crew, hit points. It's tough enough. Oh, crew uh, corridor with ladder. We want armor. Why can't I get steel armor anymore? I don't know why. We're, we're, we've got a bit more. Stone wall. Like, ship is too heavy, no steel wall, slightly reducing structural integrity. We can put on, uh, it's actually, I think it's under structural. We could put on like a grand or a large keel. Can we actually slap that on the top? I actually think we can. See, it increases the hit points of everything, which is Unusual if you ask me. But I don't mind it. It's going to help our castle be strong. Castle strong. <laughs> we could make a land-based carrier. Actually. We're going to put a little auxiliary. Little auxiliary air force on this guy. And I'll fill in those shapes there. So we have a little auxiliary air force for backup. And now we're getting into the extremely ridiculous cost. I love it. Muskets, grenades, tracks. Nope, that seems fine. So now it's into the basic shape and fitting out job. We'll fill this in. And um, yeah, we'll get this bad boy geared up. Let's have a look. What, what else could we do with... Like, do we want... 
We do want a bunch of shapes, but I gotta I gotta fix this out properly or it's gonna look ugly. Give me a second caller. Well, unfortunately, we're gonna have to stop there because anything else I add at this point, I get complaints about uh, structural integrity being being uh, insane. So instead, we're just gonna add some random danger stripes to this thing so that it just looks a little bit a little bit bestial which I think it does it's a little bit like our buildings but somewhat more chaotic and then we're gonna save the money if we don't already have it we're gonna save the money to build it because this is awesome it's got everything I ever want from just about anything um, I do want to stick on I'm gonna stick on the roundel because that's associated with our large our largest vehicles usually our buildings I think that's fine a uh, what is this a large flag uh, we'll stick that at the back of the castle that's good a a la a, a, a pennant can I can I stick one up there with a the, with a crow's nest I certainly can that looks great we'll stick a little antenna here uh, maybe some kind of gold dish I don't know why. I will stick it right there. In a the middle dish, this is where we, we do all our commanding. Brilliant. And voltaic cells. We can stick some of them along here. I think that looks pretty cool. Brass pipes. Uh, where actually, I want the ones that go the other way. Where are you? Are they st uh, structural pieces? I hope not. No actual shapes, because I, I just really can't afford to add anything else. So I could do with some gold leaf. Is there anything that isn't enhanced with a bit of gold leaf down the down the side of it? That's what I want to know. Yeah, it's going to be the Weta, named after a native New Zealand bug and, of course, company. So let's save this thing and then get to building it. Wet, Weta. Okay, save design. Save. Oh, we can build it straight away? All right, do it. Let's, let's crash this bad boy into something. Well, I've got a bit of a treat. I've built another wetter down at the bottom of the map at our uh, huge... i build another one. Build land ship. Yes, build our huge wetter. It's got ridiculous maintenance and all of that stuff. But here it comes. Oh, the pirates are fleeing. We've got a pirate king who's established himself. We're going to go and attack a pirate king. <sighs> oh, it looks so cool. I just look at the outside view of that. Oh, are we even going to be able to take it? I'm not not actually sure. Aim shots, chaps. In go the planes. Uh, oh, they didn't do too well against the flak. The pirate king base is pretty massive. We got a lot of hit points here, though. Those grand keels and all that structure is adding heaps. We got 15 cannons. I don't care. You got two big cannons. That's fine. Each time you miss, you're not. You know, it's a wasted shot, but fire gets put out can we defeat them are there enough cannons there to defeat the pirate king single-handedly you know a bomber might actually have been a good idea those cannons are really nasty though I'm kind of worried about them we lost all of our planes never mind supplies of what are running low supplies of ammunition are low oh no don't tell me. We have to be able to defeat it before the... Really? Like, really? Do we have to flee? Ah, oh, we have to flee. We can't... Ah. Oh. Yeah, we... That is so... Okay, what, what is this fight? What is this fight? Oh, it's one of these. I'll oh, get out of it. You're going to instantly lose and give up. See? There's something a bit wrong with those designs. I don't know what it is, but it is annoying. Spider legs. Those are those are pretty cool too. Um, next research thing. Uh, heavy steel armor. Why not? Oh, we would need heavy cannons, deck guns, just because. Okay, so let's get our... Oh, get out of it. I don't want to have to deal with these ridiculous fights. Let's get the wetters going. So I couldn't resist having a little tutu and seeing what would happen. We just got the research for spider legs come through. I just wanted to see what would happen 
if we uh, had the spider legs running. Um, and now the speed is absolutely insane. And I'm going to totally refit for that. I think that's going to be... It's going to be awesome. What about you, pal? We're going to open you. We're going to... Weta Wuwa. Okay, Weta Wuwa. We're going to refit you as well. Okay, we have our two refitted Wetas. Let's go and take on the Pirate King. Oh, wow. That's, that's actually... There's a few bit more of them. But I think we've got a lot of guards. So let's just go for rapid fire shots at this guy. <laughs> look at that. Oh, look at the legs. 30 cannons, four planes. I could have probably put more stuff on. I think the structural integrity might have held up even longer. Come on, take it out. You want to board? Where are they going to get on? Through supply hatches? I think they're climbing down around the outside of the, the vessel now. Uh, take them out, boys. Uh... Okay, you. Why are you... Am I having to wait for you to cool, cool down on the things, aren't I? Okay. Turn around, you ridiculous vehicle. Yeah. Target this thing. Just blow it up. Okay. Fill, fill them full of lead. Nice. And, of course, the castle is still shooting at us, which is a bit of a problem. They're trying to board, but I think we should have the better of them. Okay, turn around. Little spider legs having a hard time. Flip. Flip around. Okay. <laughs> All right, you boys. Get both of you to target this thing over here. We've still got a plane up. That's good news. It's not quite as tough as I'd hoped. Like, it's pretty tough. But not amazingly tough. Come on, uh, move, move closer, why don't you? Get those spider legs bumping. Just stomp your way into these. Look, I think we're just gonna have to go back to normal fire. This is ridiculous. The cannon shots are having a really hard time. Normal fire, normal fire. Let's speed things up a little bit. How are we doing? Oh, I, th I don't know. You know what? I think we're going to flee. This was embarrassing. This is nowhere near as tough as I had hoped. So repair that. It won't take long. And uh, maybe... Maybe we'll send you up here to help another fight. But I think we're going to do that in another episode. This has been taking a little while. And these fights are getting super annoying. Super annoying. So we've got to go finish off these vessels. I actually think our chaps, our wetters will be good for that. But uh, we'll do that next time. Until then, I've been Tiny Pirate. Thanks for watching. Good night.